guys so much for being here. I hope you're safe and doing well. Today's video is going to be all about how to wear Decora fashion when it's really hot. So like right now during the summertime, it's really hot, like really terrible here in Arizona because it's like past 100 degree Fahrenheit weather over here. The AC at my apartment is not really working, so I have like my fan running constantly, but it's still really hot because it's like hot air just spitting everywhere. But that's why I have my fan here with me. And I'm gonna be sharing some tips on how to still dress Decora and survive during these harsh times. <laughs> so I have 10 tips for y'all today and these tips, they don't just have to apply for just decor. It can also work for like other alternative styles as well or if you don't wear alternative fashion, totally cool too. So works for pretty much anything, I, I hope. <laughs> Number one, the most important tip that I have for dressing decor in the summer is wearing sunscreen. Sunscreen is so important even if it's not in the summer, even in the winter time. The sun is the sun is our friend, but like a like a, a friend that is a little bit toxic at times. But it's really important to take care of your skin. Your health is the number one Thing that you have to remember. And of course, also staying hydrated with water. I always have this giant jug of water with me. You know, you wanna be cute, but you still want to be healthy. Okay, good. <laughs> Number two, using your natural hair instead of wig. So I feel like over time, people kind of have this misconception that to wear decor fashion, you have to have colorful hair and like bright, colors and stuff but you really don't have to you can use your natural hair even if it's all black blonde if you have your roots showing and stuff that's totally cool too if you look at pictures of decor kids like back in the day there was like that time period when they would just use like their black hair like their natural black hair to wear decor look so yeah don't feel like you need to have colorful hair and i find that you know not wearing wig my head can breathe a lot better if your hair is really long too i would recommend tying it up so i have mine in a little ponytail right now you could do two ponytails which are which is really cute um or little space buns would be cute too i have a bunch of ideas for hairstyles and i tried to do a video at one point on like sharing examples of like how decora hairstyles quote unquote but honestly you can use pretty much any hairstyle number three so instead of putting stickers on your face so as you can see i'm not really wearing any stickers i've just got makeup on my face i would recommend instead of that wearing glasses instead so you can get any pair of like you know get some sunglasses or regular glasses and just plop pop out the little lens part over here or if you want to use like your prescription glasses and you don't mind gluing on some little cabochons like little thingies on it to decorate it a lot more to go with your decor outfit i recommend doing that i really love the glasses look i feel like it adds another extra layer to a decor outfit and especially with the thingies on the side and a while back i saw sprout cake so what they did is they got these like clear glasses and like the eye part was covered too and they pasted some stickers on it so instead of it being on your face it kind of looks like it's on your face but it is on the glasses on like the the rim part of it and recently i saw someone else do like do a really cool transformation of their glasses where they like painted it and paste it on a bunch of gems and stuff it's so cute so yes i highly recommend do wearing glasses instead of putting stickers on your face because it can feel really like especially when it's really hot and you start sweating and then things start like falling off and stuff it gets a lot so at least with glasses you know it's just kind of like holding it on the bridge of your nose and on the sides it's not really touching your face so much and if you ever want to take it off you know just take it off but if you do have to like wear glasses for like eye eyesight purposes to see if you go to the dollar store they have a lot of like glasses some glasses and like i said just you know pop out the lenses that's what i do for the glasses that i have even the rainbow ones like the rainbow heart shape ones that i wear a lot 
I pretty much, they're just sunglasses that I pop the lenses out. Now for layering clothing. So the clothing pieces that I recommend, I recommend using vests instead of wearing like a long sleeve jacket. I really love vests a lot. I've been really into vests lately and I am planning on releasing a bunch of vests for my brand candy trap at some point. Vests, tank tops, so kind of like this one that I'm wearing right now, sleeveless, short sleeve or loose sleeve tops, crop tops, clothing that have like holes on them, like sort of like a mesh sort of kind of thing, rompers, shorts, skirts, sandals or like platform sandals, crocs, and also hats. Hats are great for like covering your face as protecting you from the sun or like visors and stuff like that. So these are the pieces that I recommend layering on top of each other. So I have my short sleeve tank top thing and I have my romper overall thing that is over it. So I'm not wearing like too many clothing pieces, just a few and I'm mainly focusing on the accessories for this decor look. So, you know, I've got my bracelets and my rings and all this stuff on my head, but leaving my arms bare and it's, it's great. I can like feel the air and it feels really good. Now on the topic of clothes, the material of the clothes is very important. So you wanna try to like wear clothing that's very breathable, like 100% cotton, silk, linen, or you know how like athletes, they wear that sort of like stretchy material, I would recommend wearing something like that. And which brings me to my next point. Think of Decora as a sport. And these athletes, they are sweating and they're running around and doing stuff. And we are also sweating and running around and doing stuff. So, you know, we're gonna sweat a lot. I'm sure that there's some kind of like cute sweatband on there out there that someone could wear and use as like a cute accessory maybe like sew on some beads on it or something i feel like that would be cute that would be a cute and fun diy idea you gotta keep cool with a fan you know you could get like a really cute fan or even just a plain fan and perhaps you could try to stick some stickers on it. I think that would be really fun. And of course you can also use an umbrella. I know some Lolitas, they use like a parasol, really cute like frilly ones to go with their cords. So perhaps you could find like a really colorful or a an umbrella that matches your outfit. If you are able to stay indoors, <laughs> go to like indoor events. So if you are gonna hang out with your friends somewhere perhaps you could go to like an indoor mall that has AC or um, watch a movie at the cinemas which is indoors um, or stay in like a shaded area so if you do have to be outside you know try to stay underneath those coverings and under trees and things like that um, kind of like you're a vampire trying to stay away from the sun <laughs> Now I think about it, sometimes I feel like that, like when I'm trying to get to my car, I'm like, ah, like running or with my umbrella or my fan and just like covering myself. I'm like, ah, no, not the sun. So yeah, try to stay indoors. And if it ever feels like too much, this is like, even if it's not hot or, you know, whenever you get like, everything just feels too much, it's like sensory overload or stuff like that. Take a break, you know? Uh, you don't have to wear it for hours and like I always say, you know, you wear decora because you want to because it makes you happy. So don't force yourself if like, let's say it's just too hot, you know, perhaps maybe another day when the temperature is a little bit better or when you're doing a different sort of activity where you're, you don't have to like walk around too much. And like I always say, you know, your health is the most important. You don't want to get sick or fall ill because of decora, which would be very sad. I, I don't want any of that to happen to y'all, okay? So please take care of yourselves. Yeah, those are the tips that I had. I hope that it was helpful. And if anyone else has any helpful tips for staying cool and nice and funky fresh wearing decora in the summertime or hot weather, please leave them down in the comments below. I also would like to say a huge thank you to my 
patrons oh my god so here are all of my lovely patrons you can also see them in the description of the video so if you would like to see your name here or have your name in this description i also send out monthly bracelet packages so if you'd like that as well please check out my patreon patreon.com slash cybergirl c-y-b-r-g-r-l also leave it a link down in the description but yeah Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!